Hello everybody, my name is Chad, welcome to another MLB 9 Innings 23 video, and in today's video, first off, I want to say I'm sorry for this video running late today, I had no internet when I came home today, so I've basically been able to record this video, but I'm still here waiting for my internet to come back, so uh, it will be uploaded as soon as possible, I hope that it will be within the next couple of hours, because otherwise I will post a YouTube article, or whatever it's called, post saying that I've been having these issues, but... If you're watching this, then the good news is, is yes, in fact, the internet did come back. So today we've got some premium skill change tickets. We got like that deal, like when you buy the whole five packages of the PSETs, you get like the five free ones for stars the next day. We got that package. We got skill changes. We've got some premium packs to go through today. So you guys know the deal. Let's get into the video. First things first, let me lower the volume because I know it's definitely on. And then we will go and do our daily back. So let's go see what we get. Hopefully we finally get a legend. Can you imagine if we got a legend from a daily pack? Oh my lord, that'd be so crazy. Not today. Take a silver, free silver. Thank you very much. All I hear is yelling upstairs. Fantastic. Okay, so let's go open up our premium packs first. I've been contemplating the possibility of me opening up the, um, not opening them up, but like, like turning them into team select packs. Like, you know how you can, um, combine them now so that way you don't have to worry about having to like open all of them you can they like, can turn them into other packs i was thinking maybe i could do something where i turn them into some kind of team select pack like uh exchange how many does it cost ten hmm I don't know if that's worth it. I mean, I would love to pull, like, a team legend like Garrig or, like, Goose Gossage. But I feel like that the rate of you pulling a legend is way higher. Like, just a random legend is way higher from a normal pack, personally. I don't know. You guys let me know what you guys think about that. I don't know. I've been thinking about it in the back of my mind, but I'm not sure if it's really worth it. I don't know. The number of people I've seen actually pull a legend from a team slide pack are vanishingly small. Um, it is it is definitely a rare thing to see. So that's why I'm kind of on the fence about it, thinking like I don't really think it's worth it, so that's why I kind of like I'm not really I'm not really down with that sickness. You guys can let me know, but I'm fairly certain it's just not really worth my my time. I'm not really sure it's worth getting rid of those other legend chances to do it. Oh well, I guess we will be... See, the thing is, that I need golds and more than I need the diamonds. I need the golds for the combos. Charlie Morton. Cooking Carrasco. That's another gold. Thank you very much. Need the golds more than I need the diamonds. That is a fact. Because uh, I have uh, more diamonds and I know what to do with at this point. Honestly, the only point for me to have the diamonds is just to combine them away. Take that. We got plenty of silvers going to come in later. A lot of combos off the silvers, at least. At least we're getting golds off of the silvers. That's pretty good. Got Gibson. Let's keep on opening up some of our premium player packs here. And then we'll save some of the silvers so that way we can do some combos later. Not even a diamond on that one. Two golds. I'll take it. Can I get, like, the last six? Yes, I can. I know you can also get a legend from a silver pack, too, so I'm kind of hopeful that maybe we'll be able to actually get lucky and pull maybe a legend of a silver pack. I definitely saw it yesterday. Someone pulled a legend of a silver pack, so I'm hopeful that we will one day be able to achieve our goals and finally live life like some people, we just pull legends on the fly every day. You know, no big deal. That'd be cool. Oh, well. Would be nice. I'm still working on trying to figure out how I can set my webcam up to record my hands. So that way I can do my card pack opening video. Like, it's not going to be, like, it's tremendously important for me to save the video. Because I don't think there's anything in this pack that's even worth any money. Not like I'm doing it for money, but... You know, I know everyone who breaks open card packs wants to find that card that, like, you know, makes them a tremendous amount of money. But me, I'm just kind of doing it for fun because, like, I thought I'd, I've got this old pack of cards, you know. Be cool to see, you know, what we can find in there. 
I guarantee you I will know almost nobody from this pack of cards either. I know you guys like to make fun of me for my mispronunciation of names and the fact that I don't know anybody. Well, that will be for sure on display when I open up these packs of cards because I don't know who any of these people are. A couple people. Like, I see Kurt Schilling on the front. Obviously, I know Kurt Schilling. But, like, the rest of the people, no idea. No idea. No clue. Couldn't tell you. And I'm also think that we're getting close to the point now where we're going to actually be able to see what the... Um, I'm still waiting for like the news article for about uh, the uh, the improvements. Oh, there's a Prime there. Zach Granke, that's a brand new one. Thank you very much. Not the Zach Granke, the original Zach Granke Prime, but that's a brand new one. That's pretty cool. I'm still waiting for the news post to come, the news post to come out about uh, describing the improvements to the... The OVR improvement package that you can purchase, the one that has the the old one that had the sick change in it. Um, so waiting to see what they're going to be doing and what they're going to be replacing that with, because um, I think it's time for us to actually get some information on that front. Not this one, although I could purchase this one, but I don't like to purchase that one because the the uh, blues and greens are way overpriced. Like the normal ones are, I think, like fifty dollars for five. For five or is it three? I think it's like three for fifty. Oh, I didn't. I was lo not looking at my screen. I did not realize I just got a Kevin Euclid Prime. <laughs> I looked down and I'm like, oh, I didn't get a combo. Oh, shame. I went to go combine him. I didn't realize I just got a Prime. I was like, I was looking up in the air as if you guys could see me, and I'm just like, huh. I'm like wondering, like, like, ah, uh, oh, like, what, what's the answer I'm looking for? I don't know. <laughs> Crazy. I thought I already had a Kevin Euclid. I don't remember. That Zach Rank card looks pretty sick, though. I'm not going to lie. Let's see, I think we got one combo, and I might want to save some of these silvers. Although, we will get some from Team Select. That's pretty good. Hopefully, I get a gold from this. I know we'll get plenty of golds from the Ultimate Vintage. And the Ultimate Vintage. We'll get plenty of golds from the um, Ultimate Packs. It's pretty cool. We got two primes today. Although, I swear I already have a Kevin Euclid. Yankee Legend. I want to see real quick. Uh, let's see, Boston. St. Louis, Washington, Atlanta. Uh, how do they like sort teams through here? Did I already go by? Yeah, I have a Euclid and a J.D. Martinez ready. For some reason, I don't know why these are not together. That's super strange. Okay, so I already have a Kevin Euclid. Not really a new card. That's fine. Uh, I still got to go do a couple prime combos, but again, I'm like running out of stars here. It's like tremendously expensive to run prime combos. Seems like it's like exceptionally expensive to run prime combos. Like it's what, like a thousand stars to combine primes, I think, for no reason. It's very weird. I don't know why that's so expensive, but sure, fine. Jose Leclerc? I really don't have no idea. I'm guessing at that point. I think it's Jose Leclerc. I don't know why, but I think I've heard that name before. So, see live season players. Anyone? Yankee, John Carlos Stanton, out or out injured already. Sadly, unfortunately, miss him. I want to see him get back in this lineup. He was off to a good start too. No legend. Matt Carpenter, twenty two. Legend. That's a legend in my eyes. No legends. Ah, Jackson Frazier. I don't know why he's even, like, still in the game. I don't think is he must be in some minor league somewhere, but he's not in on a team like on a major league roster right now. So I don't know why he's still in the game. Don't give me an Aaron Hicks card. Stop it. Stop trolling me. So painful, man. God, I can't imagine he'll be on this team for much longer. I think Aaron Hicks is going to be gone very soon. If anybody want my expert intuition, there you go. Let's see, I got a live season diamond at least. Nice. Ryan Thompson. Take Hauser. Let's combine these dudes real quick. Now that we've got a full roster, we're finally getting to the edge of this, like, the achievements where I'm actually getting all of the cards now. Combo. Please combo. I don't know what's going on above me. Omar Narvaez. See if I can get some of these diamonds out of the way, because we're gonna get some more diamonds real soon. Michael Chavis, 
Is that... I don't know how to say his name. Aquino. I, I don't know how to say his name. I have no idea, but I, I remember him. He got off to such a crazy tear a couple of seasons ago. Not a gold, a diamond, and a silver by Isaiah kind of Falefa, unless I pull another one right now. Give me that Jacob deGrom. Jacob deGrom. Nope. Not great. Okay, is that enough space in my roster to fit all these uh, ultimate packs? I really don't know. Let's find out. So there isn't really anything newsworthy for me to even talk about right now. We're all still, just like I said, in a holding pattern, waiting to see what's going on. I'm still waiting to see if they're going to have like a premium blue and premium green sale pretty soon. I'm trying to see if I can purchase some of those. You know, the ones that aren't like, you know, extortion or prices, like the ones that are currently for sale right now. I'm not buying those. Like, it's just not, not a fan. Team Slat Ultimate. Give me a Goose Gossage. Goose Gossage? No. Nah. No legend, Aaron Judge. That's a pretty good one to pull. Diamond player select. Jacobs is a pretty cool card. So is that Stanton. Uh, uh, I'll take Castillo. No one really to pull from there, unfortunately. No one we're really looking for. So I'm hopeful that the skill changes will be a little bit better than these cards are. Newcomb says our Hernandez. Live Diamond Wishback, Team Slight Diamond. I got this from the event, the current, like, the Legends event. Let's see if we get. Give me Goose Gossage. Nope. Chris Grant, that's a pretty good card right there. Pretty nice. Pretty nice, man. Not gonna lie. I love that we hit it around the nose, too. It's 206 on the nose. Dead even. Perfect. Couldn't have asked for anything better. Look at all these golds we got, man. We got plenty of combos. Give me some more golds, honestly. This is the weird situation where now, because there's no gold packs in Master League, I now have to beg for golds. So weird, dude. Look at that DJ. Let's take the DJ. I'll do the DJ or the Diamond. Thank you for the DJ. Appreciate it. Not bad. Matt Brash, dude. Matt Brash has some nasty stuff. I watched Matt Brash the other day when he was on Pitching Ninja. Oh, my goodness. Matt Brash is, is another one of those, like, Andrew Miller people where it's like he's supposed to be a starter but can't pitch as a starter. But, like, as a reliever, guy's electric. I don't know what it is about that. But uh, that, that's not the first time we've seen it, and it will not be the last time. Like, it's just impressive to watch. Like, people, like, for some reason, there are these people that they don't have the stamina or cannot, like, get into, like, a groove like a normal starter can. And those people are, like, Matt Brash and Andrew Miller for some reason. They are just nutty. And that Roy Oswalt. Nope. No Roy Oswalt. Hmm. Three diamonds, four golds. All right, let's combine these last dudes. Then you get the Sir Anthony Dominguez. Then I get a Clayton Kershaw. Okay. So we'll hold off on everybody else for now. I think we ended up like exactly the same number of guards we started with, which is crazy to me. Give me a legend out of the premium vintage pack again, please. Nope, not today. Billy Wagner. Nice. That's a pretty solid card right there. And I got a bronze too, which means we got a couple combos. Minor grade increase ticket. Yes, please. I'll take that. Muy bien. Top end grade increase. You'll love to see it. Okay, let's see. Combine these dudes real quick. I thought we had some players in the backup that we can use. I got the Hank Aaron and the Kevin Mitchell. Is it Kevin Mitchell? Yeah, that's what I thought. We're going to combine the Hank Aaron. You can do this like every month, I believe, where you get like free vintages every month, basically. You get one of them for free. So we are just going to be hopeful that we can maybe get a card out of this. We'll see. Got a couple combos. Very exciting. Let's get rid of the Silvers first. Raider... Nice, and I got three golds now for the three gold combo, right? There we go. Sick. Cool. Oh, man. Not today, unfortunately. We did just pull a legend, so can't get too upset. 
can't get too upset, but still sad whenever you have that many combos and don't pull anybody. Especially since we're only basically like one card away from a three diamond vintage combo again. Alright, see what we get. I'll say this for next week. Let's go move on to the skill changes. We're probably going right back to using the Montino Martinez right now. Um, still waiting for those blues and greens to show up, so going to see what we can pull when those finally pop up. Hopefully we can get some better skills on him. That'd be pretty cool. Oh, nice. I got free five skill changes out of that. Pretty cool, bro. Not great levels. Let's keep on trucking. Oh. Uh, okay, levels. Still not good enough levels, though. Golds? Those are good levels. Not great skills, though. That's half the puzzle, getting good levels. I'd like to see a legend skill. Triple threes. Come on, baby. Give me a blue, man. Give me a blue skill. I only got five left. That's six down. Ooh, that's actually pretty good skills. Sluggers and Charisma Training Junkie. We'll save that anyway, and we'll probably short Training Junkie. And then we'll just um, see if we get a blue. Is that better than what he has now? I mean, it doesn't hit BIU, does he? I don't think so. Even with the new, like, the way we know that BIU works now, I'm pretty sure the Tino does not hit BIU as it is right now. Psycho Instinct, leg day. Oh, funny enough, leg day. All right, last one. Please, man. No, a single blue skill. Oh, that's okay. We get one more try, though. <laughs> we did the whole mileage. Let's go, baby. One last chance. Come on, give me pie, give me like bad ball hitter. Oh my god, didn't even get it. Twelve PSETs, no blues. Should have seen on average one, but that's okay. Let's go run our skill changes, see what we can pull. Going back to Grandison again because we've got nothing better to use them on at this point. Because our bullpen is basically you know blues or bust, and then um, he's probably the first one out of the lineup anyway. So just seeing if I can get a minor improvement on him in the meantime until we can you know see if we get another stake change or not we actually like i said we really don't know still waiting to hear if we even have one and then i said a couple videos ago when i say a couple videos ago i mean like months ago when they first announced this i genuinely do not think that there was going to be a, a sick change ticket coming out but i'm holding out hope that just in case there will be Okay, well, we got 32 chances left, because that's going to not, that one's no bueno. Oh, good. Triple golds and triple garbage. Awesome. It looked so good, and it ended up so poor. How did this happen? Eh, bad levels, not great skills. Train Junkie is just not that good. I mean, that's just the thing. Train Junkie is just not that good. Like, I'm cool with it on Tino as a third because I'll short it. And I really would like to have another guy with Charisma at the back of my lineup because Charisma is basically the gold standard. But, like, I don't have a lot of Charisma in my lineup. You'd be surprised. But uh, I could always deal with a little bit more. You know, it's always a give or take. Spotlight, BIU, uh, he does hit BIU, he's one of my better batters, but you all used to say that, oh, I triple one's bronze, amazing. <laughs> Didn't realize that that was what I just rolled. Brutal. Laser beam, better machine, SI, not great. If it was anything other than laser beam, I'd be like, yes, thank you. Five gold skills in a row. Professional Slugger Instinct. The second I see flashing leather, you might as well just throw it out. No thanks. Oh man, dude. This is I feel like it's gonna be one of those videos where we just get absolutely nothing. I mean, we did get a new prime. I mean, yes, that's pretty cool, but oh my goodness, dude. 
So unfortunate. 11 PSETs, nothing. All these skill changes, nothing. No legend. Come on, give me, give me a skill like in the last five. Bad Machine. Yeah, the rest of it was pretty trash. I could take Bad Machine as a third. Last one. Oh, yeah, man. A lot of skill changes on Granderson. Just nothing to show for it. All right, well, that's going to be everything for me, you guys. Thank you guys for hanging out with me. Thank you guys for hanging in there because, I, this, like I said, this video is super late, and I apologize. There's just nothing I could have done waiting for my internet to come back. So, anyway, I will see you guys in the next video, and hopefully you guys have some better luck than I did this week. But then, that being said, uh, you got to take the chances to succeed. So, you know, it's all about stacking up as many chances. I'll see you guys next week. In the meantime, have a good day. Be safe.